many schools you got that are not, they can't open them? We opened a new school to this week. We opened Tyndall Elementary this week. Wow. Um, there's some schools that will not reopen. The high school on the beach went back to their location yesterday, which was a huge blessing. We're taking in donations of pajamas and we have stocking stuffers and all that kind of stuff. Everybody's been so generous and helpful yeah. and so hopefully we can make our kids have a happy Christmas. Merry Christmas. More than one toy. That's, That's the goal. Yeah. Originally we were like one toy a person and then now we're like maybe you can get two. Yeah. <laughs> so our goal was 14,000. We will have met that by the time today's over. So maybe we can go from there. Awesome. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. Well, we're praying for y'all. Thank you. We need it all. Thank you. Have a good day. as long as God wants us to be and yeah you know my next step is when we get volunteers is to go we got magnets now enough to cover the whole road yeah so if I get crews in but we can walk up and down the, the roads and then yeah. we can go into people's yards yeah and then you know you know what happens then you get to share yeah. the gospel that's right I personally led four to Jesus but uh, Billy Graham's people were here and there was people every day coming to Christ. And then we were praying for people and you could just feel the presence of God. I mean, like I've never felt it before. Amen. So I'm asking you guys, if y'all would, to pray for revival. Yes, sir. Uh, you know, we Amen. need it across the whole nation. That's right. And God sure has allowed things to happen. So right. gotta get our attention. Sure. Yeah. How long have you been here in Mexico Beach? I have been here February, I'll be 14 years. And you're from where originally? Um, I was born upstate New York. I lived there till about the age of five, and so I was raised in Central Florida all my life. Okay. You know, God's just been supplying every time. We start to get overwhelmed, and believe me, there's been a lot of days. The next day, Beverly and her crew will come in and be like, <laughs> praise the Lord, you know? And then, you know, and then, you know, the, the people from uh, ten Tennessee or Kentucky, we got people that come in, they plug in with Three Circle Church. They came in and plugged in so many people. Yeah. So many people. Southern Baptists, they come in all the time. Yeah. And just, um, I just, you know, it's just amazing. If we did something in our county to help you guys out, what what would be the best thing for us to do after the first of the year for you guys to help you? I'll I tell you what, send people that can, is not afraid to share the gospel. Yes, sir. All right, we need them. But we need also people to walk beside them. Uh, with these uh, magnets. Yeah. I really think we could cover all of Mexico Beach and the surrounding areas. Okay. If I got, you know, we need about 12 in a group. But man, it's, you know, you're just going to have a good time talking yep. about Jesus. But you've already got the magnets. I have the magnets. So you just need to all we need is the people. people. Okay. And then any, any okay. construction, you know, anybody that has construction experience, we have some stuff in the church that needs to be done. Yeah. Uh, you know, once we get to, the, the roof seals. I don't know what the next step is, so I'm praying for wisdom. Yeah. I'm praying for strength and I'm praying for revival. God, we're sitting right here in an area that's just devastated. And we can't imagine what people are going through. And uh, so Lord, I, I know that many of them will look to the church. And so I pray, God, that you'll use this church, God, right here to be a ministry, to be a lighthouse, just to uplift the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and point people to the cross, God.